Doing what needs to be done to satisfy the customer, delivering excellence and not having any waste around that. As you can uh, kind of see behind me, from a body construction perspective, everything's in and we're in our tool trial phase. So we are building units. The tool trial process is the beginning of our trajectory to start a production within the factory. Building the car successfully with the tools, verifying that simulation work and implementing it as quickly as possible. The tool tryout process is just that. As we go into release candidate, as we go to starting of production, we're on a continual climb to more production, higher quality, and always confirming that for every car that we build. I look forward to coming into work. Like I, I genuinely wake up, I'm like, what problems can I solve today or what do I get to try out today? There's not a one single day that is dull. It's pretty exciting every single day here. Every day is different. Being able to work on these cars on the cutting edge technology is unlike any other company I've ever worked for. You can walk right down and see cars being built. Over in the battery lab, you see batteries being built and it's all the parts that you've been designing. A lot that we've bought gives us the ability to expand. Not only would we expand in jobs per hour, we would also expand on selections that the customer gets. We got to build the factory exactly how we wanted it, exactly what delivers to the customer, exactly the investment required to do that, and exactly the value that we deliver to the corporation. That Greenfield strategy is the way to do that. One of the advantages Lucid has is our drivetrain components are incredibly compact and power dense. We push all those components down and away and give all that extra space to the passenger compartment. And launch not just a brand new car, a brand new factory, but a whole new car company. My name is Mike Boyke. I'm head of Arizona operations for manufacturing. My primary role here is to build, run, operate, and expand the factory. We're competing against the best in the world, and we know it. When we designed the factory, we had to be high quality, so the processes and the materials that we use are nothing but the best in the world. The paint shop is the foundation for the entire site, so we got the latest and greatest paint process. We have the latest and greatest materials, and we have a high-powered team of engineers and manufacturing professionals. 
My name is Bobo Bojanaya, but most people call me Bobo, and I'm the head of manufacturing engineering at Lucid. The paint shop is the corner piece of this facility. It's groundbreaking because it was designed for this product. So for example, if we had gone to a brownfield, we would have got this massive building that would have been underutilized. Paint shops require a lot of energy. So to save the environment, we decided to build one paint shop that's expandable and can handle our total volume on this site. So there's a lot of work to be done. We're over doubling what we have today for our next phase of production. My name is Leslie Williams and I am the leader of the paint shop at Lucid Motors. My responsibility is to process the car through the paint shop, all the while making the best quality vehicle to deliver to the general assembly team. Our paint shop at Lucid is located in the center of our current plant. It's the heart of the plant. We are the first thing that the customer notices about the vehicle, the richness of the color and the, the appearance of the finish. Behind me, you're gonna see a lot of empty desert, but that's a future factory. Right now, we're just under a million square foot. In the end, we're gonna be five million square foot. It's a remarkable expansion plan. Our phase two is already being kicked off and we're always future ready. I'm responsible for all the people, processes, and tooling where we actually put together the vehicle. In General Assembly, we get a painted unit from paint and we have three primary zones. We've got trim, chassis, final, and then end of line. We do have some robots and we do have automation, but this vehicle is put together by humans and it takes real craftsmanship to put together. My name is Jay Sargelski and I'm the manager of launch and production operations for General Assembly here at Lucid Motors. GA is pretty amazing because it's the culmination of everything that makes Lucid special. We take beautifully painted, sleek body, all of the powertrain technology with the drive units and the battery packs, the expertly crafted interior components, the software technology, and we bring that all together and we send it out as a finished product. My favorite part of it is just the work between operations and engineering. It's a collaborative process and it's happening through every station in the factory right now as we're building. Quality control is at the end of General Assembly in order to make sure we are sending quality. My name is Federico Tapia, and I'm the head of manufacturing quality. This design is complex, not only in the appearance, but functionality. So we need to make sure that the car we are delivering to our customers is working properly. The handoff with General Assembly starts in the roll test area, and we take the car to squeak and rattles and water test, then to the pre-delivery line, we are evaluating 11 subsystems, powertrain, body, interior, exterior, chassis. My name is Hector Rascon and I am the vehicle evaluation manager. We take the car and make sure that the car is free from defects. So we inspect the whole vehicle, 100% of them, for more than 180 attributes. And then this vehicle is shipped. Once everybody is agreed that the car is okay, we take it to logistics. They are in charge of taking the unit to the shipping yard. This is not only the traditional car that takes you from the point A to B, but you are living magic while driving this vehicle. <laughs>